What happens when you go to the gym, you do a workout, but afterwards you're feeling like, oh, okay, I could have maybe done a little bit more. I didn't really achieve what I wanted to achieve. You know, what you're communicating to yourself there is that, you know, going to the gym that day was a failure. Okay, you didn't, you didn't sweat as much, you didn't work as hard, you didn't, you know, you just didn't do whatever your expectation was. You, you have these musts, okay? You've said you must do this, you must do, burn so many calories on the, you know, the, the machine, the particular machine you're using. You know, you must do this many repetitions, it must feel this way. And you start feeling like you've just let yourself down, like you haven't achieved those goals. But really what you're communicating to yourself is again, that failure. Okay, you're communicating these negative things to yourself. What you really wanna do is in that moment, zoom out and see it for what it is and acknowledge that you took all these steps just to get to the gym in the first place. You still got to the gym, so you still made progress. You still made more progress than if you had have stayed home in bed. You've got to acknowledge that. Now, as a habit, if you keep zooming out, um, you know, again and again with repetition, what you're going to see is you're going to start to see just, you know, for yourself, the way that you were conditioning yourself, you're going to start to see that conditioning effect. You're going to see that the relationship you've developed with yourself is much, much more important in the long run than the outcome in the short term, okay? You're going to have that growth mindset that we are seeking. So maybe you didn't clean the whole house that day. What did you tell yourself about the experience? You know, have you, have, you, have you blamed yourself for that? Have you put yourself down for that? Are you saying things like, oh, I should have cleaned the whole house today? I should have done this today? I should have done that today? I hope not. I hope you're acknowledging that you did the vacuuming. You can do the mopping tomorrow. I hope you acknowledge that, you know, you did the washing. You can get to the rest of it tomorrow. You can break cleaning the house down into steps, achievable steps. You can do a little bit of cleaning each day. Maybe you didn't burn as many calories as you would have liked to. Maybe you're not down to that ideal weight that you have planned for yourself in that particular week. So what, who cares? In 10 years from now, that's not gonna mean anything because in 10 years from now, you're gonna be where you wanna be anyway. There's steps we need to take to get there. Acknowledge the steps. What you tell yourself now and the mindset that you have is going to make more difference in 10 years from now than whether or not you cleaned the whole house today.